I've cut a piece of skin and I've just used a piece of blue painter's tape and taped it onto this tile. You can see the back is very different than the front. So I have cut a bunch of strips already. And what I wanna do is when I cut my, I wanna make sure that my blanks are gonna fit on here for when I do my weaving. I like to leave it a little bit long too, um, just because it's easier to manipulate. So what I do is using a straight edge, I will just make like quarter inch cuts. Oops, I'm not gonna weave this whole thing because it takes too long, but I just want to show you. That's an X-Acto knife. I also like to use these scraper blades. I get them in like the Home Depot paint department. They're about four inches long. They're very stiff and sharp. So they do a real nice job on the paint skins. You actually have to use a little more pressure than you would think. I'm not real fussy about them being exact or, you know, perfectly straight lines. Uh, I think it just adds a little, little character to your weave. So what I will just Why is that? There we go. Okay. This is just over, under, over, under, over, under. You can get fancy and start doing two under, two over. Makes a completely different looking pattern. And then I'm going to use the back side. I think it adds a little more interest. Just flip these guys all down. Use your blade, you can just kind of slide it up. And then we just do the opposite ones.
So just to save time, I am not going to weave this all the way down, but you can see how it looks. When I get my pieces all woven in here, then I will take a piece, another piece of blue tape and just basically tape the bottom edge, locks it in. And then I can pick them all up, as you'll see in the next video, and do the rest of the process.